what's up guys welcome back to drew tutorial and if you're new a special welcome to you so guys in today's video i'm going to show you how to remove the background of an image in canva now guys if this is something that you'll find useful go ahead give this video a like and if you're seeing the channel for the first time feel free to subscribe to the channel so that you'll never miss out when i release future videos just like this one no if it's a picture that you uploaded right you will be able to find the picture under your uploads on the left hand side like i have here however if you want to use a random image from within canva you can find it under photos so all you have to do is just simply click on photos and you'll be able to find a lot of photos that you can choose from you can also use the search field here to simply type whatever you want and you can find lots of images now i will take this photo for example and I will drag it onto the Canva here. Now, in order to remove the background from this image, all I have to do is just simply click on the image. You want to ensure that it's not the background that is selected, but the image itself. Then once you do that, you want to click on edit photo, and then you will have the BG remover. Now, if you notice guys, there is a crown over the BG remover icon. It simply means that you need Canva Pro. However, if you don't have Canva Pro, and if you'd like to use Canva Pro free for one month, all you have to do is just simply register on Canva and you will get the one month free trial of no extra cost. It will ask you to fill in your PayPal details or your credit card details. However, you will not be charged. So you can feel free to continue with the subscription after 30 days or you can cancel before you have to pay. Simple as that, right? Now, once you have this, guys, all you have to do is just simply go ahead and click the BG remover. And if you look at this, it takes a second for the background to be removed. You can always resize this the way you want, as you can see here. And also, you can put a different background if you so desire. Let me go ahead and do so. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to simply ensure that I click on images again. And I'm going to just simply type something like background, right? As you can see there, and hit enter. There will be a lot of different backgrounds that I can choose from and I will just simply choose something random. So let's take this one for example. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to simply click it and add it to my Canva here. And the next thing I will do is just simply right click on the image, go to layer and I will do send to background. As you can see, it is now in the background. I can resize this the way I want and it will be in the background of the image. You can always adjust it the way how you desire. Another way how you could easily do this, guys, is just simply click on the image, go to position, and you can always set it to the background here if you so desire. Very easy stuff, right? So let me go ahead and adjust it to be my background image so it fits nicely with my image. And have a look at that, guys. Now my new image has a different background, and it really looks like the girl is in this room very easy and very simple now guys i really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful and if you do go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below i'd really appreciate that and if you've seen the channel for the first time well, welcome to drew tutorial i'm anjo and i really appreciate if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community and also so that you'll never miss out when i release another helpful tutorial just like this one thank you very much and see you next time